Hi Meg. I thought a quick video might help uh, to show you how I'm going to fix a couple of these things that um, you asked about in your email. Okay, so I'm on Kristen's uh, member page under Team, and the first thing I'm going to do is uh, change her email so that the little envelope shows up. Um, and I see that you've put email under email, which is great. Um, but for this purpose, that's not where we want it. It's not really obvious, but I'm going to highlight this and copy it. I'm going to scroll down to where it says member social link. I'm going to add a new one and choose email and then put it here. Oops. And then I'll save it. Now, that, that's not real obvious, but the, the little envelope is one of many social links. So if you had a website or Facebook or Instagram or something you wanted to include, you could do that too, and it would just put in the icons. Um, the email where you put it will actually show the address if we tell the front end to show the email instead of the social link. And the envelope just kind of hides the email um, and makes things a little more concise when people have long emails. Okay, so the next one is the order. So I'm going to go back to all members. And then I see Kristen here at the top. We're going to put her under Janice Fanjoy. So here, let's see, there's Janice right here. So what I'm looking at over here, it says she was published at on 5:16 at 2:36. Now Cassandra is at 2:37, but we're going to try and put her there anyway. So we want her after. Let me see. Right under. Jan okay, so after Janice. So we want to make her at 2:37. So I'm going to come up to Kristen and I'll do a quick edit. I can change her to June 16. Uh, it would be May 16 because it was on 5 16 2024 at 237. That would be 14 37. And we'll update that. Now let's see if she changed places. I went to the front end. I'm looking to see she is now after Cassandra. Okay, so we might have to edit Cassandra's time. Let's go to Cassandra. And she's also 237. The next one is 245. So we have a little room there. Let's make her at 240. So let's go quick edit. May 16th at 1440. And we'll update her. Let's look at the front end and, oops, and see if she changed her order. Okay, so now we have Janice, then we have Kristen, then we have Cassandra. So that's how you change the, you got to kind of fudge the, the date and time to get them in order. Um, okay, so the last one is the picture. So this picture, I use a program called uh, Fast Stone Image Viewer. You can Google Fast Stone um, and download it. It's free. It's very nice for um, editing images. Be very careful. Um, the address is faststone.org, not .com. The .com is a malicious website that will lock up your browser. Um, so I'm going to go to faststone here. And you can see uh, faststone up here in the corner, faststone image viewer is what we're looking for if you're going to download this. Okay, so. Here's some other images. I have a folder of your of your images that I've fixed, um, and I keep them all at 640 by 800. This one's a little small, but Faststone can fix that. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna double click on her, and I'm gonna come over to the left side. And when I do, this menu pops up. So I'm gonna hit resize, and I want to make the width 640. That's way too high, but that's okay. 640, click OK. Now, it looks a little grainy now because it's so big, but once it goes back small on the website, it'll be fine. So now I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to choose Cropboard. 
and down here in the dimensions I'm going to put in 640 by 800 and that gave me a perfect 640 by 800 box I can move this to where I want it and I'm notice I'm keeping her eyes at uh, two-thirds height of the picture that's just good composition for a portrait I'll click crop there she is and then we're going to do a save as and I'm going to name this one just a little bit different I'll put a hyphen there I'm going to save it and then I just hit escape okay so now I have her cropped image I can go back to the website whoops went back to the website and we'll go back to team go back to Kristen and you know how to do this part I'm going to remove this set her image upload the new picture There's Christian with the hyphen. Set to featured image. Update her. And now let's go to about refresh. And there she is, perfect size. Anyway. Hope this helps. Let me know if you have questions um, or if there is a better way for me to communicate this to you. Thanks. Bye.